Dear viewers, welcome to the YouTube channel H2 Work Chemistry. See, we have been uh, watching the videos related to chemistry and um, the learning of the concepts will be made easy here. That's the specialty of our channel. And if you like this video, subscribe and click the bell button to get the notification instantly. Like and share the videos to know that the friends can understand the chemistry easily. Now, in this video, we are going to talk about the calculation of number of atoms present in 1 gram of gold. 1 gram of gold, they have provided the atomic mass of uh, gold is 198. Okay, what is the formula? See, when you calculate the number of atoms from any given data, first you convert the given data into number of moles. So, that is the best idea because one mole of any substance contains 6.023 into 10 to the power of 23. So, the first step to calculate number of moles. So, we know the familiar formula, the number of moles is equal to because the mass is given. So, we have to calculate the number of moles with respect to mass. So, the number of moles is equal to given mass by gram atomic mass. So, so, this is the formula number 1. So, after calculating the number of molecules, we want to calculate the number of atoms. Right? The number of atoms is equal to number of moles into Avogadro number. So, this is the idea we should know. Now, you take this as in formula number 1 and formula number 2. Now, substitute this formula number 1 in formula number 2. Because the number of moles we can replace by given mass by gram molecule the gram atomic mass. So, after substituting we will get the formula like the number of atoms of gold is equal to given mass by gram atomic mass. So, instead of this we have written this into Avogadro's number. Into Avogadro's number. So, we know all the data. You just watch given mass. It is nothing but 1 gram of gold and gram atomic mass. It is nothing but 198 and uh, Avogadro number is 6.023 in 10 to the power of 23 atoms right so this is the idea we know now so gram gram get cancels so the what is the idea here 1 by 198 into 26.023 in 10 to the power of 23 we have done so now i want to make this as a whole number to divide by this number so what i'm going to do i'm going to split this 23 into 3 10 to the power of 3 in 10 to the power of 20 understand so that i can multiply this term totally so I want to make this as a whole number, so that's why I'm doing this. So now 6.023 into 10 to the power of 3 into 10 to the power of 23 divided by 198, which is equal to if I multiply this, this is 1000, 1000 into 6.023 into 10 to the power of 20. So the answer is 6023 divided by 198 into 10 to the power of 20. So what we have to do? 6023 divided by 198. If you calculate that, that's this. We have got 30.428. 30.428 is the value we have got. So 30.428 in 10 to the power of 20, which is not. So the value we have got is 30.428. So, so if you substitute here instead of this, the answer will be 30.428 in 10 to the power of 20. So now, if you move this decimal here, we have to raise one point. So 3. 0.0428 in 10 to the power of 21 we have got. So, the answer we have got is 3.0428 in 10 to the power of 21. So, 1 gram of gold contains 3.048 in 10 to the power of 21 atoms. So, that is what the calculation we have done. I hope this video is very e easy in um, giving the idea to calculate the number of moles. If you like this video, share to your friends and I hope the learning is very simple here. Thank you so much. Keep watching.